to LA's most hated. Man, bro, you know, this shit crazy, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, the situation with the blueberry bitch, I kind of left it alone because I felt like... I feel like he's the motherfucking police, my nigga, to be honest with you, my nigga. The nigga always talking about he don't fuck with rats, he don't talk to rats, but the bitch-ass nigga just did a whole fucking interview with Clownface, a non-snitch who testified. Then... Then on top of that, they called the called the PC yard in the pen and had the nigga speak to these niggas. Talking about you don't fuck with argue with rats, you don't fade rats, or you don't go back and forth with rats, nigga, but you were just on the podcast with him. Not only was you on the podcast with him, my nigga, you talk too fucking much, my nigga. You one of them niggas. You feel me? All a nigga gotta do is send a bitch to you, nigga, and give you some potter, nigga, some drink, nigga, and you gonna start running your motherfucking mouth, my nigga. You the same nigga that got on YG after Draco died. Nigga calling him a pair of my ass nigga and all this shit, nigga. And you dry snitched. And you snitched on the nigga. I ain't even gonna say dry snitch, nigga. You clearly let us know what it is, my nigga. So we gonna play this video real quick and I'm gonna show y'all, nigga. Like, this nigga just be talking out his motherfucking ass, nigga. Then the nigga, hold on. I'm, I'm gonna wait till after I play this. Let me play this shit real quick so y'all can listen to this clown snitch all on no jumper, nigga. This nigga all on the stand tell it. Listen to this shit. Learn how to separate that shit because you making a mockery out the set. And that's where I, I, I intervene. Like, Drake, I'm not from the set. So, all that shit, that's what happened. I'm just mad at your decision. So, it's not a beef because that's not a homie. That's from my hood to where I could bring everybody in. Like, it's a personal, like... Now, this is my thing, though, right? Why would you get on a platform and say some shit like this, my nigga? Like, I don't fuck with YG, my nigga. But to say, token though, bro... This ain't bull right here, my nigga. This just a nigga that's talking too fucking much, my nigga. Like, this nigga talks too much, bro. Then you get in there talking about, oh, Snoopy not from L.A. Like, nigga, how I'm not from L.A., nigga? Dead homies, nigga. Like, like you know how many school motherfucking yearbooks I'm in, my nigga? For me, Cinchy Park, nigga. Audubon, nigga. Chavez. Like, what the fuck is you talking about, my nigga? You don't make no sense. Yeah, I went to school in the IE for a little bit, my nigga. But I do have a L.A. unified school district history, nigga believe that shit, nigga. Do you? You feel me? I don't know if you do or you don't, because I'm not looking that deep into who you are, bro. Like, nigga, I don't care. All I know is, nigga, you feel me? You repping the, you repping the same name of the nigga that killed Nipsey, nigga. And just based off that, nigga, I don't trust you, my nigga. You feel me? Like, when I met you, it was bold, my nigga, but I expect for you to switch up on me, my nigga. Ain't that what Eric Holder did to, did, did to Nipsey, my nigga? Shook his hand, everything was bold. Walked off and came back and smoked them. Nigga, you practically just did that to me. Nigga, we shook hands. Everything was bold, nigga. And no jumper, nigga. All that, my nigga. Whatever. Uh, uh, whatever I felt like, you know, you felt like, you know what I'm saying? I disrespected you or whatever, blood. We could have came together, did a video, let the public see us together, nigga. And I could have cleared, I could have cleared that up, bro. But you want, but you so worried about being accepted by the little, the little neighborhood community because you ain't a real one, my nigga. You gonna lean with whatever the niggas you think is reputable has got to say, my nigga. But I fuck with some real sick souls, my nigga. I'm just not gonna put all their name, put their names on the internet because they real street sick souls, my nigga. They don't wanna be in this little bullshit you got going, my nigga. Cause you already, nigga, you know what I'm saying? You feel me? You already, nigga. So, nigga, all that shit. All that shit you talking, my nigga, like, that shit don't even mean that, nigga. Like, now you lying. You one of the niggas that keep talking. You keep talking, 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 and start contradicting yourself, and we start getting lies. Snoopy not from L.A. Bitch-ass nigga, I was born at Kaiser Hospital on Rose Clans and Clark, nigga, in the city of motherfucking Bellflower. You ask everybody how far from Compton that is, nigga, that knows, nigga. Where was you born at? Put that out there. Where was you born at? Probably nowhere near the 60s, my nigga. Feel me? Kaiser Hospital on Rose Clans and Clark, nigga, is closer to Bompton, nigga. It's real close to Bompton, nigga. Pyro, nigga, ask, nigga. So, nigga, you, you acting like you know my background and you don't even really, you don't even know my background, bro. I got too much family running around that motherfucker for you to try to say a nigga like me ain't from L.A., nigga. You don't make no fucking sense. You talking about your ass, nigga. But that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to come with the facts on your bitch ass, my nigga. Feel me? Since you so worried about niggas not being from motherfucking L.A., nigga. C-Mac not from L.A., 
the nigga you dick ride and praise, nigga that y'all let run around this motherfucker talk about some motherfucking yeah, like, some neighborhood like this, and some neighborhood motherfucking that nigga. So nigga, nigga, that's the nigga that's not from motherfucking L.A. Matter of fact, nigga, we gonna play this video right now, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Proving that C Mac ain't even from L.A. Watch this. I'm gonna show y'all how these niggas be contradicting themselves, bro. We about to get into this video because, you know, I just think it's weird that nigga, oh, he not from L.A. He not this. Like, my nigga, you don't give a fuck about who not from L.A., who real, who not a rat. Nigga, you just did a whole interview with Clownface, homie. That's G-Face new name, y'all. It's Clownface. You just did a whole interview with Clownface, who's a known snitch in a hood hopper. And on top of that, my nigga, you did another interview with a homosexual. Then on top of that, you fuck with this nigga who we know not from L.A. You feel me? So we're going to get into this video before I really rip these niggas in half and say what I got to say. Being said, let's get right into it. The story begins about an hour and a half east of South Central LA in the suburban city of Rancho Cucamonga, California. If you're unfamiliar, this is where the movie Next Friday was filmed. No more luck force! Gracias! But it's also where a young man named Trevor Heard was born in February of 1993. Despite living in the suburbs, life was not always... Hold on. 